Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel Trend with Emmanuel. In today's video, I'll be sharing with you guys a little secret about the seraphic miracle water owned by Evangelist Ebuka Obi. So without wasting much of the time, let's go straight into the video. Wake up in the night on your water. <laughs> and I'm doing this for one of the things I'm doing. Really? Really? Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel once again. I'll be telling you guys some secrets about the seraphic water owned by evangelist Ebuka Obi. I received so many gullible comments when I previously talked about the water. Mind you, this video might get some of you upset and also might make most of you feel good. If you're meeting evangelist Ebuka Obi for the very first time, Chukwebuka Anoze Obi is a Nigerian evangelist, singer, author, teacher, and prophet. He was born a twin into a devoted Roman Catholic family in Imo State, Nigeria. He is the pioneer and spiritual director of Zion Prayer Movement Outreach, a non-denominational ministry established in 2009, headquartered in Lagos, Nigeria with over 170 branches worldwide. He is also the founder of Seraphic Home Foundation. He established a table water company called the Seraphic Water. Now, in my previous video, I talked about the water and I didn't talk against it. And so many people misunderstood what I said and took to the comment section to drop their opinion about it. Some said in the Bible, Jesus used water to heal I am not doubting or disputing that fact, but my point of reference is that that water sold to them by evangelist Ebuka Obi will only deviate their trust from God to the water, as some of his members use the water to travel with the mindset that the water will protect them from evil. Instead of teaching your members how to be conscious of the ever-abiding presence of the Holy Spirit, you prefer to bless water and sell it to them. I am not in any way condemning the water, but their trust has been on the water instead of God. Now, some said Jesus used water to heal the blind in the Bible, which is true. But did Jesus sell the water to them? The answer is no. Moreover, the blind man's trust was on Jesus before Jesus instructed him to go and wash his eyes in a particular pool. So you guys should stop misquoting the Bible that Jesus used water. I hope you guys will not misquote or misunderstand me because I never said the seraphic water is fake or it doesn't work. If it works for you, then it's fine and perfect. Let me see your thoughts and opinion under the comments section. And before you leave, do well to hit the subscribe button and smash that like button. Thank you for watching and see you in my next video.